For the past several years, I have been um, wanting to practice my Braille instruction. And before iBraille came along, I was using the Duxbury Braille Translator running under Macintosh OS 9 through the classic environment. Once Leopard began to take hold, Classic was no longer supported at all, period. Um, at least as far as I know it wasn't. And it, it definitely was not included. And I wasn't about to pay $30 just to have one program. In the sense that, uh, you know, you get the backfall of Classic um, as opposed to the, nat the nativity of OS X. E anyway, I don't have to worry about that anymore because of iBraille. Let's go ahead and launch iBraille. So, uh, here we are. We're going to enter a new Braille document. We're going to select the American template. Now, I am just going to type a little sentence here. Oops. There we go. Um, notice that when I hit the Y, it does nothing. But if I hit F, S, oops, F, S, J, K, and L, watch what happens. That's a letter Y. The reason is because we are in six dot entry mode. And I typed in here, hello YouTube. The, a, the SDF and JKL keys are now my six dot braille keyboard. So let me go ahead and clear all of this out. Let me show you how this works. S, D, F are dots 1, 2, and 3. So we have from top to bottom on the left-hand side of the cell, which is, uh, this is a cell, this, this, um, here, let me show you over. I'll uh, write a space here. This area here with the faint little dots here, that's a cell, that's an empty braille cell. So we have dots 1, 2, and 3, and then J, K, and L are 4, 5, and 6. So let's go ahead and go through the alphabet. A, now like I said, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I'll keep this up as a reference. Excuse me. So t pay attention to that, all right? So, so here we go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, oops, Z. So that's the whole alphabet in Braille. Now, let me type out my... Um, my screen name, RML. Now, how do we get numbers in Braille? Well, just like there's a pound sign on a touchtone phone, um, there is, or the hash sign for those of you in Europe, there is a number sign for Braille. That would be dots 3, 4, 5, and 6. So we have our number sign, 6, 9, 5. So there's my YouTube screen name in Braille. Now, in addition to this, we also have contracted Braille. Now, contracted Braille is, um, it's like, it's shorthand. For example, BRB is shorthand for Be Right Back. Well, we've got shorthand in Braille that, that um, we have, uh, we have single letter contractions. For example, B is the word but, C is the word can. We have two cell contractions with, for example, dot 5L, excuse me, dot 5T is time, dot 5W is work. Um, I believe, I'm a little bit rusty on this. Um, I think 456W is world, but don't quote me on that. Um, but you get the idea. So let's go ahead and type out something in, contracted, in uncontracted Braille first. Um, so here we go. Let's type out, uh, 
Oh, I know. Today is, what is today? Monday. So here we are. Today is Monday. Now I'm going to do a new line. Oh, I forgot one thing. Uh, capital sign. Capital sign is dot six. So let's go ahead and return dot six again. Today is Monday. There we go. Dot five D for day. TD is the word today. And let's see. What else could we type? Let's go ahead and type YouTube. And again, new line. U two. Except um, you would want to go ahead and put it as two words, otherwise it would look a little it would look funny. Um let's see, what else could we could we do? Um oh braille. Let's go ahead and type braille. So I'm gonna type so that's in uncontracted braille. And braille in contracted braille, there's actually a three-letter contraction that means the whole word. So B R L. Oops. So B R L means braille. Um, those are the ones that I remember off the top of my head. Um, let's see. Anything else? Not really, but you get the idea. Um, this is six dot entry for contracted and uncontracted braille. And you can type, you're pretty much free to type whatever you want. Again, SDF and JKL are your six dot entry keys. Um, that's pretty much it. Um, again, iBraille, let me let me give you let me give you the website here. It's indexbraille.com slash products slash software slash iBraille three dashes braille hyphen editor hyphen four hyphen mac dot aspx and again I'll just do a quick pan and scan of the website and again if you need to pause the video to get this down go ahead and do that but this is amazing I absolutely love this I braille the braille editor for the mac uh, that's pretty much it so let me just type one more message real quick. Oops. Oops. It's a lot easier to do this if you only have six keys to work with, but when you have six keys amongst a whole sea of keys, then you have a problem. So. What did I type here? Goodbye, YouTube. And that's pretty much it. Um, thank you for watching. Any questions are welcome. Um, and have a nice evening. And by the way, like I said, um, that 456W for world, I think that's what it is, but I'm a little bit rusty. So I do apologize if I'm incorrect, but I don't think I am. Um, if I am, I do apologize. Uh, thank you for watching and have a nice evening.